hello guys in this video we will see how to install nessus tool that is vulnerability scanner tool on windows 11 operate go to google and search for nessus essentials download click on it click on this tenable nessus essentials vulnerability scanner i will keep this link in the video description see this is the link i will keep in the video description now we have to register to download the nessus essentials Then once we click on get started, we will receive activation code to this email. Okay. So give the valid email. Click on get started. Click on download. See here the available Nessus version is 10.7.2 and select the platform. Then click on see select windows and click on download. Select I agree. See download has been started. Go to downloads. Click on this MSI file to install. Click on next. Click on I accept terms in the license agreement and click on next. See this will be the installation location. If you want to change, you can click on change and you can change. I am okay with this one. Click on next. Click on install. See this is the activation code that I have received. See, we will use this activation code when we try to connect to Nessus Essentials dashboard. See, installation has been completed. Click on finish. See, this is the, see, this is the console. See, this is the URL to connect. Okay. Bookmark this one. If you, if you forgot this one, for safe side, bookmark this one. Click on advanced. Then click on proceed to, see, it is giving error. Click on proceed to local host. Unsafe mode. Click on, see, we have the two types. One is register offline and another one is continue. Continue means we have to give the activation code. Click on continue. Then select the start trial of Nessus expert. Then click on continue. Then skip. See, because we have already activation code. So click on skip. Then provide the activation code. It is there in my mail. So copy this one. Copy it. Go there. Paste it. Click on continue. Then confirmation. So click on continue. Then we have to create the Nessus administrator user account. So provide the name for the administrator account. Can be anything. Okay, click on submit. Setup completes completed. See now it is downloading the plugins. Waits until this plugins download completes. This may take time. Okay. See, this is the Nessus dashboard console. Okay. See, it is installing, it is downloading Nessus plugins, core components. Click on account, then click on my account. If you want to change the password or username or full name, email, password, you have to change. Then you have to click on save. Cancel it. Scans. See, still these are downloading. Okay. After downloads, we can be able to create new scan okay all scans we don't have any scan these policies and other also will be enabled after these core components installation finished okay see plugins compilation is completed see now we are able to click on create scan or you can go to here click on create scan okay all are working even you can create the folder okay even you can import 
anything okay so if we go all scans there also we can create see before the policies and plugin rules terra scan these are all disabled if you click on policies create a new policy see we have the different options okay see here this needs to be upgraded my scans click on create new scan select it basic network scan then here we have to provide the name then description then target target see here example is like ip or we can give the we can give ip range or we can give the website name also suppose i want to give this name as first scan first scan give the same give that respect to scan see we don't have any folders so if you want to get folders you have to go to dashboard and you can create the folder then it will be visible here okay then give the target one so i want to give my local ip only ip config ip config copy anyone paste it okay save it you want to schedule when it's new to you have to enable this one and you have to provide the timing okay if you want credentials you can give as far as it you have to provide all the information like public key username and all for windows windows you have to give the username password and domain name if you are okay with that one you can save or launch okay click on save see for windows you need to provide the username and all okay these are all required see here this is required this is a way to go to scan new folder first first click on create if you go to the scans new scan select basic network scan in the top down see here we have the folder name okay this is the way if you want to see the policies click on new policy select basic scan here name then give name credentials ssh is for the linux machines or mac we have to give the we have to select password or anything okay this is the way to create the scans if you want to see the plugin rules create it click on this plugin rules and click on create a new plugin rule here you have to provide the host name plugin id expiration date and severity low from low info to critical okay settings this is the license utilization see we have user 0 of 16 ip 16 licensed ip addresses okay so if you want to update you have to select the daily weekly or monthly plugin details okay if you want enable plugin location locals you can encryption password events see these are the list of the events okay this is the activation code and this is the plugin set plugin version and all license expiration is this is the license expiration date okay and we have installed 10.7.2 on windows so in this video we have seen how to install and configure nessus essential software on windows 11 operating system for more nessus or linux or Cybersecurity videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.